Building Rhythm Games in Unreal Engine Part 3 We want to bring your attention to the default rhythm actor class variable. This is where you'd set which blueprint or class will be used to spawn a rhythm actor. It gives you the opportunity to use your custom classes. Ensure your class inherits from the Rhythm Actor class. Next, you'll want to override the Initialize Rhythm Actor or MIDI Note function. This is the opportunity for you to decide which mesh and which input the Rhythm Actor conforms to. The function is called automatically from C++ and provides the MIDI note that triggered the spawning. You should use this information to decide how your rhythm actor will look like. You'll also want to set the corresponding input action needed to score. When done, return the modified rhythm actor back to C++. Rhythm Tools uses the new enhanced input system. Browse the contents of the input folder to see how these are set up. You should also open the process input function and go through the nodes. You can add your own logic here. Rhythm Tools uses MIDI Engine and the Spline Architect plugins to drive rhythm actors. That summarizes the Rhythm Tools plugin. Join us on Discord and we'll answer any question you have on Rhythm Tools.